Hey, Damien, just checking up on you. Uh, I know uh, funerals can be tough, man. I'm fine. Do you need anything? Uh, I can be there in less than 10 minutes if you do. I'm fine, Paul. Are, are you sure you're fine? I, I know she helped you a lot with the rent. If you need some extra cash, my boss is always hiring. I can handle myself. Well, if you change your mind, I'm here for you, man. Also, I, I am sorry for your loss. Your mother was a great person, and she will be missed. <laughs> Wanted to come by, but you know your rent's overdue. You really have to do this to me on the day of my mom's funeral. Day after, actually. Also, your mailbox is full. Thanks, Mark. Hey, is everything all right? Why don't you have me rush over here? I got some bills in the mail today that I cannot pay, so I figured I'd try to sell some of my mom's stuff to try and make some money. Oh. Why are you going to pawn off her stuff? Why don't you just get a job? Quick money. I don't think she'd want all her things pawned off. She's dead and I'm broke, so what she wants doesn't really matter right now. Damien, I, this is crazy. Why don't you just keep all the things that she left for you and then come work with me? I mean, I can get you an interview tomorrow. I'm fine, Paul. I can handle myself. Okay. Well, if you're fine, then I'm going to leave. Give me a call when you come back to your senses, Damien. Who are, you? Who are you? How did you get into my house? I'm Jean, the genie. You summoned me, didn't you? Bullshit, you do not look like a Jean. Okay, yeah, well, I don't sound like one either. Answer me, how did you get into my house? I told you I'm a genie. Here, let me prove it to you. To wish for something. I want a new phone. Okay, great. And I want a new house in the Hamptons. You have to say, I wish for a new phone. I wish for a new phone. Holy shit, you weren't lying. Okay, come on, wish for something else. Uh, I wish for a sports car. Right, last wish. Make it count. I wish for one million dollars. Okay, are you sure? Because you know I could give you something nice, like true love or anything else. One million dollars. Okay, one million dollars coming right up. Don't be reckless, kiddo. can you afford a brand new sports car, right? And you can't even pay me my rent. Who are you to question my purchases when it's none of your fucking business? I am so done fighting with you right now, man. Oh my God. You, I want my rent money, but tomorrow you're out of here.
got your money, Mark. What about my money, kid? Who are you? Don't play stupid with me. You lost $500,000 and ran off with your chips. Does that refresh your fucking memory? I'll pay you, I swear. I know you will, kid. Get your shit. Get out. Okay, buddy. You? You set me up. I lost everything. You did this to me. Are you shitting me? I didn't do anything. If anything, I was trying to help you. Yeah. Yeah, and I needed that help so badly. Yes, you did. Don't even try to deny it. I know you, man. I've been sitting on your mother's shelf for the past four decades since before you even picked me up. I've been here since before you were born. Yeah? Bullshit. Prove it. I thought I taught you not to call bullshit on me, Damien. March 16th, 2000 is your birthday. When you were 10 years old, you dressed up as Darth Vader on Halloween. Your first pet was a cat named Joe. But most importantly, you didn't tell your mother that you loved her before she died because you were too busy trying to take money from her. You are a self-centered, narcissistic, raging fucking asshole. You know what? At first I felt bad for you. You know, I wanted to try to help you. But now I realize that you deserve all of it. You think that the world should just go your way, but that is not how it works. So then what do I do? I have nothing. I don't know, and I don't care. Good luck trying to figure it out. Hey, Paul. I came to my senses. I do need your help, and I'm sorry for being an ass. Are you okay? What happened? I lost everything. My car, my money, my apartment. Well, I mean, you still have me, buddy. You can crash at my place while you look for a job. Is that interview with your boss still available? For you, my friend? Of course. Are you far from your old apartment? No. Okay. Yeah. Stay where you are. I I'm coming to get you now. Thank you, Paul. 